Hello everyone, this is Zekushan from Twitter. Today we're going to talk about uh, downloading the Shad PS4, which is a PS4 emulator uh, commit bundles. So the requirements for downloading uh, the commit bundles and using them on your PC. The first one is to have a GitHub account. So you just go to this link. If you don't have it one yet, then you follow this uh, this uh, tutorial. So you just go to github.com, you click sign up, and you follow the prompts to create your personal account. So this is only if you don't have a, a, a GitHub account. It's a fairly straightforward process. Uh, you just need an email, a password, and uh, to verify your email um, address so after you have an account you need to go to one of these links um, i am suggesting this for windows let me put it here uh, windows and uh, these are these are links for windows so uh, if you have linux you need to go to the to the um, to the workflow uh, of uh, Linux, or and if you have a Mac, you need to go to the workflow of Mac. So this is only for Windows. Um, so if you choose this one, it will be the normal Windows release, and if you choose this one, it will be the Qt um, uh, release. I prefer always the Qt release. Um, so I just if if I if I click on the on the Windows release. It will show me the workflow. You can see that uh, this one is already compiled. This one is ready to compile. It's going to is going to compile. Um, I, I I believe it stopped somewhere. Um, but yeah, these green ones are the ones that you can fetch the 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 build from. So you can see the windows here. Um, this one is the Qt windows. And if you, for example, if you want to download the, this uh, this commit, you just click here. I am logged in, as you can see here. And you just go here, and where it says artifacts produced during runtime, you can see here it has one called Shad PS4 Win64 KT. So this is for the Win64 uh, computers. You click here. It will download the Shad PS4 Win64 Q2. You transfer it, you open the folder, you right click, you extract, and you can find it the everything bundled up for you and as well the, as the as the the executable. So another thing that you must have in consideration is to have the ps4 modules so the ps4 modules you need to dump them from your ps4 you can use ps4 ftp with the crypt mode toggled on so uh, this is this is um, uh, ps4 uh, wait uh, ps4 no um, scene collective Collective, I believe it's this. No, let me double check. Sin, sin, um, hold on. S4 FTP. Let me check. FTP, sin, collective. So in this repo, you can find the PS4 FTP for, from the Scene Collective uh, repository, which is the best PS4 FTP that you can use. Um, this is based off uh, XVortex uh, FTP. You can use this to, to FTP the modules uh, the already decrypted. So you can use this one. Um, I believe there's there's some releases of this pre-compiled, or you can just compile it yourself. But uh, 
the majority of the sites sh should have the um, should have the ps4 ftp bundled in their hosts for example the 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 caro 218.ir for example one of on one of the one of those let me just put it here um, some site some hosts that can have it the macedo host caro host alasif host and uh, what else also i i believe that default the nb made a host but i'm not sure uh, there are more hosts uh, but uh, these are the main ones i pre always prefer the the caro host so you can always use this one i always go to um, caro 218.ir and i just choose my uh, my um, my firmware version and then i just use the ps4 ftp that comes with it so uh, these are the modules uh, so libc sc disk map libs sc jpeg inc libs sc json2 libsc libc internal libsc ngs2 and libsc rtc so uh, as soon as you start chat ps4 uh, it will ask for a directory to install games um, you of course need a ps4 game dumped i have three ps ps4 game uh, ps4 games dumped they are in this folder the call there it's called ps off games because i previously previously used it to test the games from ps off emulator so uh, this is the famicom the manu and the sos so um i just click on browse go to the um, go to the c directory and go to um, ps off games let me check here it is select folder okay and it will show these uh, these games which is uh, one of them is river city girls Re zero the other is sea of stars and there's a, a third one which is uh, sort of a, a release from uh, from the the scene called man verification disk which is used to verif verify uh, the video output of your ps4 um none of these um, of these games work so um, you can you can if you want to try you can try but they 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 will they will not work for 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 now um you can get these games from your from your ps4 you can use app dumper so again from synth collective you just go here and you go to um, uh, let me check ps4 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 i, I believe it's up to usb or app dumper uh, it, it should have a specific name to it uh, let me check let me check app dumper so here it is you can use this to dump your games uh, or you can extract it for from an f package uh, this is piracy don't ask me how to do this so uh, you can use certain tools to extract the the game from an f package and then you can put it uh, the, the folder structure it will be like this so the uh, the eboot.bin uh, must be inside the, the the primary folder which contains the, the 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 name of the game so these are the re resources uh, you mu you also must have the scec's folder uh, which with these specific files and this SCE module with the, the modules like this. So yeah, um, 
this is only for Windows, okay? So uh, if you want to go to um, to the to the Linux and the the Mac releases, it's also easy. You just go to here where it says build status. I went to the Windows uh, to the Windows Mark and then just pick this one which is it should say windows.iml and windows kitty.iml and you also have linux so linux sdl for linux and linux kitty for linux kitty and mac os again mac os sdl and mac os kitty so you just click here for example for linux and you can see here and you just click here for example you want to download this one and you can find it here so this is the main executable and this is the, the app image so you just pick your flavor and you're ready to go so that's all for today i hope you guys enjoyed the the, the, the tutorial um if you have any questions you can ask in the in the comment section and uh, i hope i will see you on the next video goodbye